Hi everyone. So I just did a whole flip through of this book and decided that I sounded too tired or something. So I'm redoing it. Maybe I'll remember to tell you everything too. So there's a thing called journaling by fives and I guess it's um, it came to me by way of my friend Karen who saw a video by a girl named Adele and Adele credited Shannon Green for this technique. Journaling by fives is where you take um, 15 minutes to do a layer on every single page in your journal and then stop and then 15 minutes for the next layer and so on. So layer one is paint. Layer two is collage. Layer three is uh, stencils and stamps. Layer four is um, words and focal images. And number five is journaling and doodling and pen work. I didn't think it could be done. I watched Adele do hers in her series of videos, which I'll link in the description thingy and I was getting anxiety watching her do it. It was so stressful. I was so excited to do this technique that I was like bouncing off the walls in the morning before we started group time. Um, my friend Karen, by the way, her group, where that's where we did this. I, I was so excited. I couldn't wait right? I had all my stuff ready. <laughs> and then as soon as the group started, I was like, my heart was beating so fast. I couldn't believe it. And I was so nervous about doing this thing. And I don't get nervous about this kind of stuff anymore. So it was kind of funny. Anyway, so get to the flip there, Tracy. All right, ready? <laughs> okay. There's my first page. I love these stencils. I can't remember who makes them. Uh, it, this woman it looks like she's on the subway, but I don't think she is because there's a lamp there. I don't remember lamps on the subway. Uh, so I'm loving this. I use some text as a background instead of using it as text. I really love this page. I'm happy the way this came out. I might journal on it, but otherwise I like it. This one needs a little work. I kind of cheated a little bit and counted a spread as a page. I mean, if I'm sitting here putting red paint on this, I may as well put it on here. So that is how this came together. I don't like this big empty space here. I love the graphite pencil here, which, oh my gosh, I love using these. This is from Lyra, L-Y-R-A, and it's a big old chunky graphite pencil. And I just love the way it feels. You have to be careful though, they break easily. See, I taped it, um, so it'd be easier to hold. But, oh my gosh, I love it. I love these pencil marks. These. This is a carved stamp that I got recently in a, an estate sale, and that video will be on my channel soon if it's not already. And stencil, that was from Stencil Girl, I'm pretty sure. And then we've got two pages. This one, I'm, I'm liking the way this one came together on its own. This one might need some work. There is some shimmery stuff on all the pages because during the paint layer, I sprayed it with an unknown brand of glitter, not glitter mist, shimmer, shimmery, misty, watercolory stuff. And let's see, there we go. This one's definitely going to need some journaling or a secondary image over here. I love how bright and happy it is. And I didn't even pull this 
word scrap to match. It just kind of, I grabbed it and kept going. So I like how that looked. I put little stitching, fake stitching border around the whole thing. And I love this color combination. Oh my gosh. I love that green. And it's not really green. It's Distress Stain. Tim Holtz Distress Stain in Crushed Olive. How delicious is that color with that blue? The blue is a mix. The, the lighter blue is... Um, Sapphire, Dick Blick, matte acrylic sapphire. And the darker one is uh, Blick, matte acrylic, dark blue deep, which is, let's see, I've got like three bottles of it. It is so good, this paint. This color is fabulous. Okay, and then um, I used some other pens and things to write on these pages, like the, the white souffle pen and the pink is, um, is a Jelly Roll Moonlight. These are so good. I love these colors, the Moonlight pens, and so far none of them have conked out on me. They all write really well. They're beautiful. And if you look really hard, you could even buy a package of a series of grays. So you got to look for them. Like Jet Pens, I think, had some. Um, the Moonlight, Jelly Roll Moonlight. So good. And I'm liking the way this is looking too. I just feel like it needs to be pulled together somehow. And this is another, oh, this, I love the way this came out. The color, I can't show it to you now. The color that I used is this hot pink, like hot pink. And when it mixed with that yellow, it just came out looking so orangey and neon. I love it. I love a lot about this book. Okay. And this is a stencil. This is a stencil. That's all stencil. What's next? Um, this one, I desperately need to do something. I was getting... I was getting a little stressed out at this point because 15 minutes is not enough time to doodle on 20 pages. It's just not. Maybe I need to watch the video again. I don't know, but I could not handle it. So I did scribbled a lot of my graphite pencil on here so I'd feel better. And then this page, I'm liking this too. I like where I think it could go. I love this image of this guy sitting on the bench just thinking. Or or what? What is he doing? What is he thinking about? Anyway, so there is that page. This one also needs some work. Did not know what I was doing when I started coloring the coloring in the eyes or writing all the text again. I, I don't know. I have no idea. And then the last page, which I am really liking. That's that dark blue deep that I was mentioning before. So if you want to do this, look up Shannon Green or ask questions in the comments. I'm going to try this again because it, it was fun and it really stretched me. And now I have this whole journal I can work in and do pen work in without going, oh, what am I going to do on this page? You know what I mean? 
really love this book. And of course, I will do my covers, and when the covers are done, I will share that too. That is all I have to share today. I hope you're doing well. Be kind. Have a good day.